Hello, welcome back, student. Uh, I hope you are fine by the grace of Allah. So today we are going to see the HTML basic tag in practical. Okay. So before going to this, first I will quickly review what we have done in the last class. Okay. So here in the last class we saw the basic html tags okay basic html tags what are the tags like paragraph okay line break horizontal heading h1 block code emphasize okay and this is subscript superscript this all the tags we used okay and if you want to use this kind of alphabets this kind of special characters we need to write in HTML code in this format so I shown you this like this are the things like if you want to insert the image if you want to uh, give the attribute the optional attributes and the main attributes okay so this thing we are going to see in today's practical class okay so first is you must have the you must have the notepad okay you must have notepad in the notepad first thing what are the basic things for the html okay you can go to this ppt and you can see what are the basic uh, here here can you see this basic first you need to write the document type you must know what kind of document and this is a comment you can write the comment in this format okay let's uh, do practice okay so here uh, give me a second fine sorry okay now in this in this we need to first what we need to do document type can you see here open bracket less than not is document type space what is the document type html okay and what we call this what we call this this is tax okay this is and if we write example like this can you see here exclamation mark dash dash okay and whatever you are going to write here like file name and document purpose and hyphen hyphen greater than that means this will not execute in the program let's see here I am writing this is uh, first page first web page if you directly close this it will not show the error but this contain will be display on the website okay we will do the mistakes and see how the mistake is reflecting on the website also so this is a comment syntax okay this is a comment syntax now now what is the next line here HTML language okay HTML language is equals to EN English you can write this is up to you you want to write you can write otherwise by default it will take English so here HTML LNG is equals to double quote EN okay like this clear okay now in the HTML the basic structure the head part is very important H E A D head this is a opening tag whenever you are opening the tag you must close you must close the closing tag closing tag is head and here you open the HTML tag so you that also you must 
close html okay whenever you are opening the tag that should be close okay this is this is opening tag and this one is a closing tag this one is a closing tag okay so this heading tag and sorry head tag should be whenever you open the tag that should be okay okay so here <clears throat> okay so this is first web page and this is a comment so now we need to write html okay html or you can define uh, html whenever you open the tag whenever you open the tag you must close the tag html okay and in this uh, html html whatever you want to write you must write between these two tag only if you write anything here like something uh, p p okay this will not execute it will not in a proper way it will not show you the error but it is not a proper way okay so here we need to write the html so you can define the language what kind of language are you preferring so i am preferring english okay so you can write english so here the next one is head part whenever you open the tag you must close the tag okay fine so what is this head head is in the head is the head of the uh, above the body okay what is uh, head in the head you can use title you can use title what is title when you open the tag you must close the sorry you must close the tag otherwise you will face a problem okay so here whatever you will write here this is my first page web page okay this is my first web page so where it will display this okay this will be display at the title bar Exa example example this is notepad and the title bar is this in the title bar can you see this untitled hyphen notepad like this this is my first page will be display here okay my first page just i will write my first web page okay so this is heading okay let me execute but whenever you write the html code html should be there and after head body is very important opening tag and closing tag okay so let's save this uh, uh, let uh, let's save this and we'll see what is the output okay how to save file save and when you do the save select the location where do you want to save i want to save in the document so here i will first select all file after selecting all file write the name like uh, i will give first page okay first page dot html you must write dot html this is very important okay dot html is very very important when you are writing in the notepad 
So I am saving here first page dot HTML. Let's see here document in the document can you see any kind of file no now let's see I am saving here save I save the file can you come to the document can you see here the first page is displaying in the Google Chrome format okay Google Chrome format so you can open in any browser whatever the browser do you have I am opening in Firefox when you open Firefox let's see what will happen okay it is opening loading not now okay see is there anything displaying here nothing but can you see here my first web page is displaying here how it is displaying it is displaying because the title okay and the title is written in head okay if you change here then it will reflect over there so did you understand where the title will be display okay the title will be display here okay fine now next next go to the body in the body the basic tag as we saw here paragraph p opening tag closing tag in the opening tag you will write welcome welcome to isl engineering college welcome to isl engineering college and this is in the p what is this p p is a paragraph okay p is a paragraph tag this is what is this i will write the comment how can i write the comment paragraph paragraph tag okay and this will not execute okay and it will define this one okay now again file save I did the save go to the document go to the document click the refresh right click open with Firefox now see you can see something over here welcome to ISL engineering college and this is a title and whatever you want to display here in this whole page so this is you must write in body part in this you must write to display to display here okay can you see this paragraph tag is this is in the comment so this is only for the this is only for the developer okay not for the viewer viewer will see only welcome to ISL engineering college they will not see this one okay so this is paragraph tag okay next so uh, here welcome to ISL so I am just going down I am using the heading tag heading tag h1 as I studied in this heading this is paragraph line break horizontal heading so I am using this heading h1 ISL engineering college and that closing tag should be there okay this is h1 isl engineering college okay welcome to isl engineering college like this h1 now the same thing i will write h2 isl engineering 
कॉलेज एच सॉरी एच टू इन द सेम वे एच थ्री एच फोर एच फाइव यू कैन राइट सो जस्ट आई एम डूइंग कॉपी पेस्ट ओके हियर आई एम चेंजिंग टू थ्री हियर आई एम चेंजिंग टू फोर हियर आई एम चेंजिंग टू फाइव हियर आई एम चेंजिंग टू सिक्स हाउ मेनी हेडिंग्स आर देयर ओनली सिक्स हेडिंग्स वी हैव ओके सो हेडिंग वन इज ओपन एच वन टैग क्लोज एच टू ओपन एच टू क्लोज एच थ्री ओपन एच थ्री टैग क्लोज एच फोर टैग इज ओपन एच फोर टैग इज क्लोज एच फाइव टैग इज ओपन एच फाइव टैग इज क्लोज एच सिक्स टैग इज ओपन एंड एच सिक्स इज क्लोज ओके सो नाउ नाउ आई विल गो एंड रिफ्रेश लेट सी वॉट विल हैपन I want to show you uh, some error, not error exactly. So here, okay, I will close and open. Otherwise, you will get confused. Right click, okay, do the refresh here. You will not get the output. Why we will not get the output? I will tell you. Okay, it is displaying. Yes, yes. Okay. Now. Welcome to ISL Engineering College. But where is the ISL Engineering College? We wrote the code here. H one, H two, H three. It is not displaying here. So whenever you are writing the code, the basic thing is you must save. Basic, basic thing. You must save. Okay. Now I saved here. Okay. Now. No need to close and open again. Just click the refresh here. See, you will get ISL Engineering College. This is a H1 tag, and uh, this is a H2, H3, H4, H5, S6. So six tags we have in the HTML. Okay, like this you can display. Okay, so this is. Uh, important thing, the basic thing, basic important thing is to do the save every time whenever you do any modification here. Okay. Now see the difference here. Some of the gap is there. Okay. If I want something like I will use this one, this tag. Let's see what will happen. H R. Okay. I will use here. H R slash close. Okay, let's see what is the ba main basic thing. File save. Go here and do the refresh. Can you see the horizontal line? Can you see the horizontal line? Yes. So this is a horizontal line will be display. Okay, if you want the gap between these lines. so you can do the use break b r slash okay now go and save then go to here and do the refresh can you see the gap because we are getting this gap because of this b r and the horizontal line this is horizontal line okay fine now the next one is line break heading level block quote emphasis emphasis is nothing but like here here i am using the p tag so here can you see this is normal i want like dark i want in dark strong so you can use here B tag B is for bold, okay. Otherwise, you can use the strong S T R O N G. Strong opening tag is there. There, there should be closing tag S T R O N G. Strong, okay. Now do the save file, save and go and refresh here. Can you see it become a bold? Okay, it's become bold. 
now okay fine so it's strong code block uh, back code it just you try this all the things and we will do this also subscript okay example subscript super subscript this one so x base 2 x so this should be written x bracket open sub sub bracket close base 2 okay then closing tag whenever you open the open tag there should be a closing tag then sup super 3 superscript 3 this should be close okay okay next next is x here just now we write the code for x 2 2 to the power of 3 now write plus plus y plus y base 1 to the power of 2 base 1 means sub 1 closing tag sub base 1 and superscript superscript 2 sup superscript okay opening tag and closing tag okay so this is a simple code let's see first do the save and you can go here and do the refresh can you see here Can you see this x base 2 to the power of 3 plus y base 1 to the power of 2 okay so this is how we can write superscript subscript okay so fine okay the next one is did you understand this sub what is this x subscript means in the bottom is 2 and closing tag if uh, closing tag and sup is superscript is 3 is sup is a closing tag opening tag closing tag okay so this is uh, the thing you can get the data fine for today these are the small basic things we completed here today and in the next class we will see some more basic command basic html code basic tags okay then uh, till then thank you like and subscribe